This is Xiaomi Redmi 12C and today I would like to demonstrate that you can bypass parental controls on this device. So to start, let me quickly demonstrate that I do indeed have my parental controls enabled. As you can see, that is true. So from here, open the Google category of settings, then go for the manage your Google account button over here. Next, open data in privacy section, scroll page all the way down, tap at the delete your Google account option. In order to proceed, we will need to enter the password to the Google account, so let me do exactly that. Onwards, check those two boxes at the bottom, confirm your choice that you do indeed uh, want to erase your Google account. And well, at this point, the parental controls were successfully deactivated. So let me quickly show that to you. Well, I guess it will take some time for the system to register that. So well, let's try to relaunch the Google over here. Indeed, did not register that. Yeah. So basically, uh, since this phone is uh, very bad and its performance level is uh, well, just awful, uh, it does not uh, synchron. It does not get synchronized in the way other phones do, because usually they register the change momentarily. In here, uh, well, you can take this little text over here as a proof. Uh, saying that something went wrong and you need to sign in again. So I guess I will need to wait for this crappy device oh, already. So finally it registered it. So as you can see, the Google account over here has disappeared. And if I will open up rental controls, there will be none. So from here, the only thing that is left to do is to recover the Google account, which you can do by simply using it to by using it to sign into the Google Play Store or any other Google app. So in here, I will enter my email address. As you can see, we're getting the following message, which identifies that we did everything right. Now we will proceed or follow it by entering the password to our Google account. Nine out of 10 times you will get something went wrong message that's completely fine. Just re-enter your credentials or well, sign into your account one more time. So enter the email address, then password. And as you can see, the second time around, the system let us proceed. So we can just uh, continue with our usual Google login, accept all the services, enable backup or disable backup. And yeah, well, here you have the Google account back and the parental controls are indeed still turned off. So that will be it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for your attention and bye-bye.